I am Scott Ellsworth and uh, I have cerebral palsy and I've, uh, I've experienced a lot of different, uh, different things in uh, my young 33 years. Uh, one of the things that I've always tried to do is assist people in understanding what cerebral palsy is and how it impacts on everyday life. Hi, um, my name's Harry Greenwood and I play the role of Charlie in the short film The Gift by Spencer and Lloyd Harvey. Uh, when they approached me to play the role of Charlie, I read the script and I was really excited because I'd never met anyone with CP and so the chance to step into someone else's shoes was something I was really excited by, so I leapt at it. Every person's experience with cerebral palsy is different, so when Harry and the team approached me, we decided to undertake uh, my specific disability. Like, for example, to raise my right arm like this, you know, I've got to concentrate really, really hard on that to, to execute that movement. And does that happen in your whole body as well? Like, do you yeah, I can, I can, um, when my right arm moves, my, my left foot moves, right. so yeah. it's, you know, the whole, the whole body is in, in on the party. Okay. You know? From the first minute that I met Harry, I knew that Harry was, was willing to learn about in particular cerebral palsy and in particular my um, type of cerebral palsy. He, he really absorbed what I said and uh, he was a great person to work with. When I first walked in the room and I saw Scott, um, he gave me a big broad smile and I instantly felt at ease and from then it was just getting to know him. And he's a great guy and he's very open to talking about his disability and I think that's the thing that struck me that we're just the same, there's nothing really different. We decided to focus on the specificity of his movements and his disability. Um, so that meant restricting most of my ability to one hand. Basically with my right arm, which is the most effective. Yeah. And uh, you can see that my fingers, um, my uh, just holding my hand like it is at the moment, um, I can actually feel spasms going right through right, my okay. Once we had coffee um, and uh, we were talking about how simple tasks can be really difficult and um, you know, explained about you know maybe opening a sachet of sugar, and so I took a sachet of sugar in one hand, and I tried to open it, and as as a result, it spilt all over the table. So it kind of <laughs> exemplified the difficulty of small movement. Depending on the level of cerebral palsy that you have, um, it would be um, you would be using so much concentration yeah. on that simple task, and to rip. To rip the packet open, um, and and that's what happens. As an actor, it's really important to ask all the right questions in order to build the character. And so, in saying that, I needed to be not precious when asking Scott questions. And and you know, he said that himself. There's no question you can't ask. And so I did. I asked him everything under the sun in order to fully form this character and really get inside his skin. So that was also a challenge for me as an actor. And it's really important when portraying someone else to find the truth of who they are. And I think, hopefully, that's what I was able to do through my meetings with Scott. Are you going to open it? Maybe I'll open it later. If you like. As an actor, it's my job to step into other people's shoes and um, in this film, Scott really helped me take on the role of Charlie and meet those challenges of playing a young man with cerebral palsy and I think it's something that everyone can learn from, seeing things from other people's perspectives. If you stay in your own shoes, then you become narrow-minded and you don't live the true life experience. So I think it's really, really important to think outside the square, step into someone else's shoes and live what another person has to go through.